this is my Power Wheels build. Essentially, I got the inspiration from Steve's Land Rover. As soon as I saw that video, I started. I went on Facebook Marketplace and I looked up a TRX 700 XX. If, for someone who doesn't know what that is, it's a it's a sports quad that Honda made for two years. Just like Steve's quad, it's got front independent and rear independent. Unfortunately, I don't have that great of fabrication skills like these guys do. So I reached out to these guys in uh, Portland, who's a really good fabricator, and I came with the idea of converting this to power wheels. So what we did is we cut the air box out, put a seat there, relocated, um, we put some U-joints here, and then relocated the steering bushing down here, the stock uh, Honda steering bushing down here. And then, we located the battery, the battery was over here, and put it up front here. And then I got the body from Walmart, the stock pit lights. I just uh, drilled a hole a little bit bigger and it put LED lights in it. So. Cool. Then we put a five gallon ta tank in the back. Um, and then <sighs> Dustin worked his magic. He put this half roll cage here. Um, Put a golf golf cart saddle here. We just cut back to Idaho to tell you guys about the sponsor that made this whole trip possible, Honey. Now I know we've all been shopping online, went to check out, saw the coupon box, then wasted time looking for a coupon, none of them worked, and we lose money. Well that is exactly where Honey steps in. Now Honey is a free browser extension that'll search for all the codes and plug them in automatically, happens in an instant, to get you the best price on what you're buying online. It works in over 30,000 stores. After you install the Honey extension, it'll automatically drop down at checkout, say apply coupons, you hit apply coupons, it gets you the best deal. Honey has saved its users over $2 billion and it's free to download, so why not? Go to joinhoney.com ghpc, you can install it in two clicks, just like this, save some money, and then we're gonna time warp back to Oregon coast and send this Power Wheels. I bought a used YMZ, uh, RMZ 450 motor, uh, muffler, FMF, and he just relocated under and swapped it up here. And I'm running a uh, FMF uh, spark rester on it. So you're totally legal. You have a VIN, got a VIN and a spark arrester. Got a spark arrester, uh, got a flag, got the decal sticker, so. <laughs> Fire suppression. Uh, fire suppression. You're the most prepared here. <laughs> <laughs> got a little toolbox. Big thanks to Steve because I got the idea from. I got really lucky because I actually bought the quad from a um, a dealership, a RV dealership in Bend, Oregon. Um, so I got really lucky. Yeah, I got it. I got the quad for 2,800. I felt guilty for cutting it, but uh, after seeing all your guys' videos, I'm like, I have to. So. Yeah. Um, well, you're having more job. fun on this than you would as a quad. That's what matters. Yeah. This is way better than a quad. Yep. So that's it. How does it feel in the dunes? This is awesome, man. 
It's a workout. <laughs> good workout for sure. <laughs> Dude, that looks pretty good. I don't feel like I'm, is it, are we doing about the same thing or is he, he looks like he's diving. Like Bob. Um, yeah, you're, you're landing a little more flat. You're diving a little bit more. been such a cool week out here in Oregon and Washington. It seems like there's a Power Wheels community now that the videos have just kind of inspired more and more people to build more and more Power Wheels and we were so excited about it. We made a bit of an open invitation for people to come to this race that we posted the video of last week and that's how we met John and made this awesome video and went to the dunes. The full dunes video is coming very soon, but it is just so cool to see what other people are doing with these ideas and it's really turning into a thing. So we probably need to start some kind of annual race that we host that's officially just Power Wheels, kind of like a Power Wheels adventure weekend where we do a race, a dunes day, and an overland trip. I think that'd be super cool if that's something you guys want to see or if you have any ideas for it like where we should do it who we should invite how we should do it because we don't we haven't done an event planning before but i think it would be super cool so if you guys know a lot about any of that stuff hit us up our email is always in the description of our videos and thanks to john for coming out and making this happen the link to his youtube and instagram is below if you kind of want to see more of his build process and the other stuff that he does. And this Friday, we're announcing our next Power Wheels build, which is going to be the best one we have ever done by a long shot. So definitely look forward to that. That series is gonna go super hard. Then we're gonna finish the drift trike and we're gonna start working on the Tesla again. So it's like those three projects, mainly the Tesla and the Power Wheels, the new Power Wheels that we're just gonna go on and on and on and on every Friday about and then we're gonna try to do more fun adventure videos on Wednesday we're getting a little help in the garage so that should make it way easier for us to post more often we're really looking forward to trying to get Wednesday videos out and Friday videos out all winter so if we can do it <laughs> we can do it that's the goal but no matter what we're doing every Friday still I think I'm stuck. I got in here somehow. I must be able to get out. <laughs> I am so stuck. This is why we haven't built anything with this yet. We're still trying to figure out how we can fit. Mm -hmm. 